How's it going guys? It's your boy Pokemon Mechanic, the guy that loves his cars and loves his Pokemon. So let's hop into this. Uh, I only have one pack, but it's Sword and Shield's Brilliant Stars. So this is my first pack um, of Brilliant Stars. I have, really haven't seen much of it. It just got to where I live. I'm kind of excited to see what's in here, see the, all the new artwork, see what cards I might be able to pull. Um, but I really do like this artwork on the pack. Um, what does it say? It says, Constellations Align and a Show of Force, overflowing with light, Arceus V-Star descends from high to share its celestial powers with other Pokemon B. Shaman V-Star, Charizard V-Star, and Wemiscott V-Star find themselves wielding awesome new V-Star powers while hmm. <laughs> Mimi Q, Mimi Kyu. VMAX, Agron VMAX, and Kingler VMAX, and its Gigantamax form boosts tremendous strengths of their own. Discover glimmering constellations and start your journey towards stellar greatness in the Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Brilliant Stars expansion. All right, so let's see what we can get in here. It looks like, sounds like we can get a V-Star, so let's hope we can get that. Here's some more of the pack, some miscellaneous information, shows you this came out in 2022. So, let's see what we can pull. I'm excited. I want to see all the new artwork. This is my first Sword and Shield Booster pack. Alright, so we got the live that came with the Fusion packs. One, two, three, four. I'm guessing that the order is still going to be the same let's do a quick border check all right so we got a yellow border back there all right no worries we could still pull really awesome hollows hopefully like i said i haven't really seen much of this set that's not really what i care to see a pot helmet yeah it's setting high standards for the set no <laughs> i know there's got to be some good stuff in here so we got a sigilyph Acerola's Premonition. I don't know if that's how you say her name. I'm sorry if I slaughtered that. We got a Riolu. We got a Starly. A Milsery. What is that? Is that the glove from... Uh... <laughs> oh, what is that? Um, Super Smash Bros. I used to play that on the GameCube. That's, that reminds me of the hand. It's like a little baby hand from Super Smash Bros. Right, we got a Carablast. That's an interesting looking Pokemon. Definitely doesn't look like one you'd care to come across in the game. And it's, it seems kind of pointless. It's got a peck. That's worth 10 damage. Man, they could have done something better. Ooh, we got a Clefairy. There we go. Look at that. Back to the Wizards of the Coast Pokemon. Ooh, we got a Tropius. Uncommon. I always enjoyed playing Tropius. Back in the games, uh, back when I had Pokemon Diamond, I played Tropius a lot. All right, let's see what our rare is. Oh, it's a bust. It's a Mewtwo, but it's a bust. What? How is that not a hollow? What? Oh, man, that is a beautiful card. Beautiful artwork. How is that not a holographic? They would have made that blue holographic. Oh, that would have been so sick. I just don't feel like you should be able to decimate Mewtwo like that and not make him a hollow. What? I'm sorry, guys. I'm just old school. I love the old style of Pokemon. Once again, I'm a fan of the new artwork and everything with Pokemon, but how dare they not make this a hollow? What? That's just crazy. But that is beautiful artwork in there. I love that. That just kind of shows who Mewtwo is. It's like mid-fight. You know, he's just battling out. And you know if you're going up against Mewtwo, you're going to lose. It's Mewtwo, right? <laughs> but thank you guys for watching the video. I'm sorry we couldn't pull anything greater. But I'll take a Mewtwo. I love Mewtwo. I collect those cards. So uh, you guys have a great rest of your day. And we will see you next time.